excitement from the crowd. Here we go. Flicked away nonchalantly. First ball of the match goes for four. Oh, Pish again. Near that fielder. That'll be about it. This is a lightning quick outfield. It's a bit better, but look at that. What a gorgeous stroke that is. Runs coming in boundaries. First over's gone for 14. Well, that. Oh, dear. It had to go. Pissarro Pereira is the man at third man, and he drops a sitter. An appeal. Is that close? Yes, it's given. Trying to hit through the onside. Angelo Matthews striking for Sri Lanka. Ajinkya Rahane dismiss. Bold him. Oh, that's an absolute beauty. Ambati Raidu goes for 8. It's 59 for 2. That's a good hit. Look majestic from Rohit Sharma. More runs. In fact, four more runs. Half century for Rohit Sharma on his return to this India side. Oh, that is a gorgeous shot. This is a terrific shot from the Indian captain. Shot. Wide open space on that leg side, and it's very inviting for Rohit Sharma. One more boundary for Rohit Sharma. That brings the 100 partnership between Rohit Sharma and Virat Kohli. Very important time. That's asking for trouble. Bowling shot and a slower delivery at that under 100 Ks. These are easy pickings. First six. For Rohit Sharma. There it is, the 100 moment. The fifth 100 in one day internationals. Very well played, young man. A big moment for him. Got a big 100 in the practice game against Sri Lanka. Getting his opportunity in this game and how beautifully he has taken the opportunity. The entire team is delighted for the teammate Rohit Sharma. Another boundary for Rohit Sharma. It also gets 150 run partnership between Rohit and Virat. Straight down the ground. It's another six. This is wonderful batting we're watching at Eden Gardens. It's a third six from Rohit Sharma. Kohli's pushing hard for the second here and he's got to take it. Well, he's very fast, and he's fast thinking as well. He wanted the half century, and he's got it. His 33rd one-day international half century. <laughs> that has just raced past this Pereira. Smashed away again, four more, it's the 150 up for Rohit Sharma, he is blazing all over this ground, it's wonderful to watch. Now does it carry to the man? No, Kusal Pereira is the fielder, oh they have to hurry, oh there's a mix up, that is the end of the Indian skipper. He's run out, a real mix-up in the middle, and Virat Kohli's not a happy captain. This time he does, that's gone into the stands.
Has he gone? What a good catch. It's Mahela Chawadana. Takes a very, very good catch. A tumbling catch. And Suresh Ryan is on the way back. Straight over mid wicket with absolute contempt for the ball bowled at him. Rohit Sharma hits his 4 6. And the way he's playing will not take too much time for him to get that. One more brilliant shot of Rohit Sharma stepping out and hitting over the mid off region. Was the length well played, magnificent from Rohit Sharma. It's hit well, it's hit very well, and it's a moment of history for Rohit Sharma. First batsman to score two double hundreds in ODI cricket. What an outstanding innings from Rohit Sharma. Right from the start, he was in total control of this innings. The entire team is so pleased for him, making a comeback of his sorts after his injury in England. The first batsman in the history of one-day international cricket to get two double hundreds. Oh, that's a solid crunch. He is. Rohit Sharma now becomes the highest score in one-day internationals. He goes past Borinda Sewax 219. Now that, how do you sum that up? That is toying. Well, that will be another boundary and he reaches 250 with that. Second batsman in the history of the game to score 250 runs in a limited overs game. But this is an international. The first man to get to 250 in one day internationals Rohit Sharma one more six this time straight down the ground that's 400 out of the last ball of the innings Mahila Jawadna takes the catch Deathly silence greets it, but what an innings. Record-breaking innings from Rohit Sharma on return to the Indian team. After 50 overs, 404 for 5 India. There you are. Rahane 28, Rohit Sharma 264. Raidu missed out being bowled by Beauty from Miranga for 8. Virat Kohli unfortunately run out for 66. He also missed out on 100. Raina, 11 of just 5 deliveries. And Uthappa, a runner ball 16. 404 for 5. If you're a Sri Lankan fan, close your eyes now for a moment because those bowling figures don't make for a very happy reading. Mendes went at 10 and over. Kulasekara almost 10 and over. Matthews, 8 for 44, looks splendid in the midst of everyone there Iranga looked good for a while nine overs for 48 his last over went for plenty Sri Lanka need 405 runs to win the asking rate is 8.1 at the beginning of the run chase that is going to be out attempted pull shot it's a terrible shot Rohit Sharma you can Karan Sharma Karan Sharma on his debut Takes a catch. Nicely driven. That's a terrific shot. And nobody clapped. Stun silence. Another very, very good shot. Shot. Made good enough noise. But won't go the distance. He's just got the elevation. He'll get four more, Dilshan. Dig in. There's a man on the drive and he bowled a much fuller length. That probably is the ideal length for Stuart Binney, good captaincy as well. He gets the wicket of Chandimal. For nine, it's 31 for two. 
Now then, was there a little edge here? No, there was not. Umpire says that's gone, and Mihila doesn't like it. But it's a terrific strike again from Umesh Yadav. That's in the air, and that's wicket number four. So were you giving India a chance or Sri Lanka? Wilson going for 34 from 33. Then he's got a second, and it's 48 for four. Outside edge, that'll go all the way to the boundary. Hit on the up. Such a good cricketing shot. Four to end the over. 11 from it. 73 for four Sri Lanka. A very good shot. That's 50 for the captain, Angelo Matthews. 24th 50 in Monday Internationals. Can he get a hundred here? That'll be the question. And it's been hammered away. The Matthews who picked up the length very quickly indeed. Nice looking blow. This is into the open spaces and he'll collect six. The six of the innings for Sri Lanka. Yeah! Now then. Angelo Matthews is sticking around here, is he, or is he on his way back? No, he's gone. Umpires referred it upstairs, he doesn't need to, because Angelo Matthews is walking. That's a smart piece of keeping from Robin Utapa. He knows it. He knows that he's short. There you go, confirmation. Sri Lankan captain is gone. Bottom edge, and that'll be 50 for Tirimana. Well, that's a clean blow. Very clean blow indeed. It's 6 to Tirimana. Uh, now then, that's going sailing over long on. It's a second consecutive six. Oh, this is a great blow as well. That's gone high and handsome. Pereira is very dangerous. 200 up. Oh, oh, what a sound. Like a meteorite through the sky. This is great batting from Pereira. It's in the air. Should be taken. And easily. And it's Virat Kohli. You don't expect him to explore a catch with Dawal Kulkani picking up a wicket in the batting power play. He goes to 59. Very good knock. Will be number two. Looking to run it down to third man. Healthy edge and a simple catch for Robin Utapa. Soft dismissal. He's a big hitter, Isara Pereira, and this is a soft dismissal. And this shot. This is asking for trouble. He's feeling the pressure. Catches the call and he's taken it. It's covered a lot of ground. Third wicket there for Dawal Kulkarni. Ambati Raidu. A good feel in the deep and he's taken it easily in the end. Catches the call and it's home delivery. It's home delivery to Aksar Patel. Again, the short ball working. Wicket number four for Kulkani. He deserves it. Good thinking. Oh, good shot. <laughs> That's up in the air. Peeler under it and takes the catch. Khan Sharma ends the contest. Truth be told, it was over some time ago. But it gives India victory by 153 runs. India batting first and winning the toss 404 for 5. Road Sharma world record 264. Sri Lanka holding for 251. Four wickets to Kulkani. India winning by 153 runs.